Step right here. What? Perfect. Hit it. All right. Welcome to Seattle by Sarah. Today I go to Nordstrom and get my makeup done. I take the monorail to the Seattle Center. I head back to Beacon Hill for a photo shoot, and then I come all the way back to Capitol Hill for happy hour at two of my favorite spots. Enjoy the episode. Or I should have said something different, like. Watch next week. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let's watch next week. <laughs> all of the weeks. Just always watch it. part of Nordstrom on the first floor. They redesigned it so that it would look a little bit more like Sephora. Not look like Sephora, but be more of the like, you can do it yourself, like put makeup on yourself kind of experience. And I actually hate it, because I much more prefer when they put makeup on me and like help me figure out what I need. So, we're going this way. Awesome. I just need. Oh, thank you. Where's it from? This one? Zara? No, a friend just gave it to me for oh. my birthday. I have no idea. Sorry, he's just filming. You can just ignore him. Oh, okay. Hopefully that's okay with you. Yeah, no, that's fine. Um, so I need this, um, and I think I'm the medium dark, but I don't know since now it's not summer and my skin's getting lighter. Okay. Um, but I also. Would that be okay? Yeah. Do you already have makeup on? Oh. This is We're matching a new. Um, I don't have this kind of makeup on. I have like what I wear when I run out of makeup. <laughs> and you're probably gonna be like, Sarah, this is, you're wearing too much makeup. You look too evening, it's 11 in the morning, but I don't care, I wanna look nice. So there. I decided that makeup is the kind of thing that is kind of worth investing in because it's a guarantee. But not for all things. There's no need to invest in mascara unless you're using Dior. Um, there's no need to invest in like eyeliner, I don't think. I use like $3 eyeliner. I think it works just fine. That's great. I love it. Thank you so much. So I would love to get this. Is this the full number four you said? Yeah. Okay. It's called um, Barcelona. Barcelona. That was awesome. The NARS girls are always the nicest people at the makeup counter and they always make you look beautiful. So even though I thought I needed one thing, I ended up walking away with much more. Not only was she super nice and fun to talk to and apparently like used to read lines with Jeremy Piven, which I always love a good celebrity sighting and story. Uh, she's new to Seattle and she needs recommendations on what to do. So it couldn't have been a more fortuitous match at the NARS counter and she hooked me up with a lip gloss so that's awesome. I always cheat when I don't have time to do my own makeup or I don't like the way I look. I definitely hit the NARS counter or Sephora and get my makeup done <laughs> by one of the professionals if I have to like transition from day to night uh, yeah without going home. So pro tip definitely take advantage of Sephora and Nordstrom. Do you think the vocals takes the monorail? No, but they should. It's the fastest way to get from downtown to Queen Anne. It literally takes two minutes, and when traffic is so terrible, why not go on like the elevated highway? I mean, it's not really a highway, but it literally takes two minutes. And if you've ever been stuck on 4th or 5th Avenue, sometimes it's worth it. Come on. Hi, can I do two one-ways, please? Pretty, pretty touristy for a, a local girl like yourself. Yeah, but I like doing touristy things. I mean, there's a reason that they created them, right? <laughs> okay. We should go like this. So then it's like happening behind me. Yeah. Don't do that. Sit with me. It's too awkward. I can see you. I can see you. 
Okay, so we're about to turn a corner and we're gonna go through the EMP and that's the best part. I kind of feel like maybe we should go up the Space Needle. We don't have time for everything that we want to do. And I'm really hungry, so I think our first objective is to get food. What do you think? Okay, we're off the monorail. It took two minutes. I think it's really fun, but if you didn't, that's fine too. Um, but now we need to go get food and then we need to figure out the game plan for the rest of the day. So, um, do you have any questions? Can we go? I think we, well, we have a ton of options in the armory. Um, and I don't even know what they are anymore because I haven't been here for a little while. But I think we should check them all out, discuss, and can I help? <laughs> ah! Maybe it can't actually be helpful. I'm worrying about it. It's perfect. This is great, Greg. I don't know if you were going to make it in there anyway. <laughs> just <laughs> knocked some guy's stuff over, but I was trying to help, so it was all like in good fun. Okay, what do you want for lunch? Where, where can we eat and have a drink? I don't know if we can have a drink. We don't need drinks. Okay, what do you want What to do eat? you want to eat? Whatever. What do you want to eat? No, whatever, this is your show. You eat what you're gonna eat. I would I'll never eat just it. eat what I wanted to eat. I would always ask my friend what they wanted. So what are you in the mood for? There's a skillet. Everything. Do you want? Like poutine and pork belly and waffles. Do you want a milkshake? Do you want? Oh, they have skillet in here. Yes, they have skillet in here. Skillet has two locations: one in Ballard, one in Capitol Hill. They have a trailer food truck that goes lots of places, and then they opened up in the Armory. And this was like one of the first things that started to make this whole place a little bit more cool and like with the times. And there's a princess. What do you usually get? I always get the fried chicken sandwich with a kale Caesar salad, and I don't think I'm gonna change anything today. Um, can I get the burger with a kale Caesar salad, um, a fried chicken sandwich with french fries, and then can I order beer here, or is that? Yeah. And then I'll do, what do you want to drink? Yes, sir. Cheers. So not only are there people that just hang out in the Seattle Center, like we just did, we had a reason, it's changed, but we had a reason walking into it. And now, what was I saying? I don't even know. Anyway, I think that wine just kicked in, but look where we are. Um, our Uber's in this circle. Stay, stay there. Okay, one second. Well, no, because there's people behind I them that want to get I out. Don't care. I, need to get to I care. I know, but I need to get my lens done. Just a second. He's like leaving us. Sorry, I'm getting in. Sorry, we're trying to film this thing. Greg! Oh my god, sorry. Good, how are you? Um, I did not like that. I don't want to inconvenience anybody else while we're doing this, and that's what we just did. So we're gonna have you're to. Real, you're real star. Let, let <laughs> the guy do his job, man. <laughs> All right. As long as you're not upset with us, then I can get over it. No, but no, I was really do, frustrated. Let the guy do his job. Man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you're a real star. <laughs> oh my God. 
Now I'm feeling nervous because this is going to be a weird thing. This thing is going to be weird. If it's too weird, I'm going to make you sit outside. Okay. Okay. Also. What is the thing? Um, yep. again? Yeah. Okay. Um, we are going to this random person's house who I don't know to, um, like, take pictures in underwear, basically. But, like, tomboy underwear. So, basically, boxer briefs for women, um, which is not my style. But I think it'll be fun. And I like the idea that they're doing, like, shoots with people of all shapes and sizes and probably, hopefully, colors. And they're really excited about my hair, which I completely understand. I am always happy to be a hair model for anybody that ever needs somebody with hair like mine. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go do that. It should take about an hour and then we'll see how we feel. I'll probably need like five drinks after that. So you better be ready to maybe have a shot or something. That's it. <laughs> Here she is. <laughs> oh, she's so cute. All right. Thank you very much. Um, thank you. Thanks for being so nice and for putting up with us in the beginning. Getting out. Hi. So I feel like I know you. This is Greg. Awesome. Greg, this Hi. is Shenna. Hey, nice to meet you. <laughs> um, um, yeah. I'm going to admit while that thing's coming out, I am weird on this side of the camera. So the more focus on her and the less on me, the better. Perfect. That's just totally <laughs> fine. <laughs> Can we help with anything? Thank you so much for doing this. Yeah, it's super funny and random, so I'm super <laughs> right. stoked about it. Um, Hi! We're here to take over your house. <laughs> um, so my friend Lindsay is a uh, photographer, and this is her home. Awesome. And she has graciously donated it. Great. <laughs> Cool. Yeah, so I can become more, pretty. And I thought of her red wall. Yeah. And so I thought this could be, you know, a great lounging space. I love it. Yeah. Perfect. <laughs> I like how she organizes her books. I'm already into it. Right. <laughs> yeah, it's beautiful. Cool. In here. Awesome. Mm -hmm. Yay. Okay. Fun. So, um, Hi. Oh my oh, God. Ah, no ah. fucking way. It's you. Oh my God. We no, went to high no, school. This together. is really bad. Don't film this. <laughs> I'm in a fucking bathroom. We went to high school together. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> yeah. So awesome. Yeah. No, in Boulder, Colorado. In, in Boulder, yeah. I yeah. Was... Dude, what are you doing here? <laughs> I'm here uh, taking over your house and modeling today. Yes! This is You're super the weird. This I'm the model. Awesome. I know. I'm so happy this is amazing we're filming for my vlog which if you're my friend on facebook i know you've seen it so i'm really sorry you can say don't put this in there but this is such an amazing moment that i think it might have to oh my stay God. I'm in the oh we can recreate it when you're clothed okay you that want. sounds good i was just about to i'm feeling chilled I'm losing my head. <laughs> this is really embarrassing. we went to high school Dude, together this, this is amazing worlds collide i'm yeah. so happy right now yeah, Why no, Colorado. Uh, we don't. We just met out there like Jeez, five minutes I ago. On Facebook, and I was trolling for models, and I saw yeah. her, so I reached out. And then so. we've been doing a bunch of other things today because we just started to decide. We decided like last week we were gonna make a vlog, and so this is like our first day of like trying to shoot, which has been really difficult. <laughs> and I was like, well, I have this other thing that we could like throw in there if we want, and so that's why he's here. But <laughs> this is so <laughs> awesome. I'm so happy that I know you. I feel like. I wasn't feeling like super nervous, but now I feel like fine. Oh, you're, yeah, you're good. You're so, you're it's awesome. You're really yeah, really I'm so excited. Yeah. Okay, you go do what you are doing. <laughs> and we'll start this and then we're just gonna continue to, <laughs> we'll continue to like marvel about how weird this, this, this really is. is. This yeah. is so bizarre. <laughs> Your house is beautiful. Thank you. Yeah, I really like the colors and I really like that you color coordinate and um, Roy G. Brave your books. So, yeah, yeah. I, I already know. feel at home. Oh, good. good. I'm totally Yay. Right I know. It's so weird. Yeah. Um, okay, well, what's the real job? <laughs> um, okay, so I have stuff here. Okay. Um, Liz, do you mind if I take down Naked Lady? You can do I think. Anything. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I love your naked lady, but, um, okay, so I have stuff for you 
to model. Great. So I have a bunch of clothes. Okay. Um, and then I also have two um, items. You get to keep the clothes. Great. The, there is a bag and a necklace that... Don't That's fine. <laughs> um, but, so we're going to model those. Great. Where should I change? Okay. Cool. You might be better off in there, actually. Okay. Sounds good. <laughs> Representation is, is an important thing. I mean, as an artist, that's something that's always been representation and audience are like kind of the two biggest considerations, I think, that I've, I've gone through and as an artist through my creative life. And um, so right now, like picking out models, um, representation, I love working for a brand that wants to represent the people that it's selling to. Totally. Um, so we want body diversity, we want skin color diversity, we want... Um, yeah, we want to represent the people that um, that buy our products. So that's, that's so really exciting. important. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, like you had you wrote to me and you're like, I don't know if I have the body type, yeah. you know. And I was like, it's not about body type. We're looking for sparkle. Yeah. I mean, you know, it is. We're selling things. We want right. people who are attractive. Yeah. You know, we're looking for people who look good. Yeah, <laughs> it's not a lie. But but real people. Lots of <laughs> lots of people can look good. You don't have to look good in one certain. Um, mold. You yeah, know, you totally. Know, into one mold. I feel like we're old friends at this point, and now we <laughs> truly are. Um, thank you, and keep me posted. Let me see them sometime before they're like, well, I don't really care. I don't care. Bye, guys. Thank you. Oh my gosh. My mouth like hurts from smiling and like smizing a lot uh but that was really fun and i love that i just knew everybody it felt like it was my community sort of without even trying how cool is that this car would like to go i know that you don't like that hi no, no, no. how are you <laughs> so that was awesome and i feel tired i mean like i think it was just because it was a little bit um like my mouth hurts basically from talking and from smiling for like two hours and getting my photo taken. So modeling is really hard work, everybody. Um, but the thing I liked the most about it is that I really didn't feel like I was modeling in my underwear because it was really comfortable stuff and it was great. I really liked it. I mean, I wouldn't do, like do it all the time, but I really thought it was fun. <sighs> That's all I have to say right now. I need a minute. Sunglasses on. Here we go. Okay, we, what do I say? I don't know, where are we going? Okay, well, we're, since we're done with the shoot, we're gonna go celebrate and have margaritas at Barrio. So we're getting dropped off in Capitol Hill and we're gonna drink like probably two, maybe three margaritas. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, sorry, that was super annoying, but you're such a good sport. <laughs> Where are you? Here, set it up. Okay, we're at Barrio. We're in the middle of Capitol Hill. We're gonna drink some happy hour margaritas, maybe get a bite to eat, and let's go inside. Where's Barrio? The address? Yeah, just like across the street. <laughs> um, we're on 12th in between Madison and Pike. So basically, heart of Capitol Hill, right off of Pike and Pine. The food is really good. My favorite is the chop chop salad and I want to eat it. So here we go. Hi, how's it going? Pretty good. We're going to just hit the bar. Oh, yeah, go Thank you. Yeah. Hi.
Where are you sitting? Oh, did you want to have that for your purse? Yeah, kind of. No, it's fine. I'll. Yeah, I did actually. How are you? Very well. Yourselves? Pretty good. I need a really strong margarita. We're gonna actually each have one of those. Okay, are we done? Can I go to the bathroom? Do I just unplug myself or do I hit pause? Um, here, I'll do it. Yeah. <laughs>